see how this goes for me. I can lose a couple ships, I guess, if it means that we can get rid of pirates, but... New subscriber detected. I'm not going to be able to really run. Rebel Dragon, thank you for the 35 months in a row. Hey, okay. What? Huh? Defeat! What? Why was, what was that? Why does it say game over? I didn't lose anything. I lost two boats. What? My money was low? I was making 30k. Huh? I was making 30k. Does losing boats make you lose money? I'm making 38k right now. The city has grown ugly. Okay, I'm just not going to do uh, any of this then. Guys, I'm making a stupid amount of money. Or do you think it's because I'm buying so many items? Maybe it's because I'm buying so many items. Alright, you know what? You guys hang out over here for a while. Maybe I'm buying a lot of money, or I'm buying a lot of items from the guy. But how does that cost more than a million? I've got a, a luxury trade route. Ship under attack. I mean, I still don't see how that would ever make more than cost more than a million, though. I don't know. Confusing. Is it from this guy? I'm buying a stupid... Okay, let's see how this goes. Maybe this is the guy where I lose the game. <laughs> maybe maybe I, I'm spending like a million on this ship. It's automated. Let's see how this goes. Some of this might be very expensive. Ah! <laughs> okay. Um... Okay, we figured it out. That's weird. No, it's not the ally. It's not the ally. This is a neutral player. The war had nothing to do with it. You can't go in debt in this game, guys. Even when you're turning a profit of like 100k a day, you can't go in debt. So what did we learn? Shopping, apparently. Is the, the reason why you lose video games. Okay, so can I see how much some of this costs? It's this one over here. Over in... You know what would be nice, guys? It doesn't show you how much any of this costs. You literally can't know. It doesn't give you a price. I guess I have to manually go to this guy and then check. Ah, the gramophones cost, uh, cost a lot. They cost 27k each. No price equals free, right? That's what I was thinking. Alright, so before this boat arrives... I have to, uh, no, is it not this one? No, no, no. Where is it? <laughs> Come on, I need to find it. No, it's not that one. Ah, this one. I didn't see it. Okay, so just remove that. 
Wait, no! Oh my god, I still want to have that one in there. Ugh. Just buy a bunch of sewing machines. And buy a bunch of those, those watches, okay? And then return to Lacopia and dump all of it there. Duty done. Time for a kip. I didn't click accept yet, so I think it still bought the items. My god, what a stupid system! So this is what I mean, right? When I say, oh yeah, the game is better in the early game than in the late game. This is the kind of stuff that I feel like they just didn't properly test. It's just like, how can you buy stuff from an ally, from a neutral player, and then not check in the trading screen how much something's, like, something costs? That is, isn't that stupid? All right, anyway, it's okay. It's just one of those things that it's like, it would be a really nice quality of life change if that wasn't, if that wasn't there. All right, so let's just not buy the stupid yeah, gramophone player less. things. And let's buy half these. Let's see how much it costs me this time around. Pausing the game. So this is pausing the game, guys. You can't do anything. Pausing the game does not uh, allow you to do any trading. Well, I've been buying shares left and right. I'm getting a lot of income right now. This is a stupid amount of income. We get millions. Alright, so let's see how much this costs me now. I'm at 930k. Okay, that was about 300k. About 230-ish. Yeah, we make a lot more than that. You can't trade. So here's another frustrating moment. Look, look at this meme. Look at this meme. So say for example, right? Wait, what's going on over here? Oh, we sold one of those boats, I guess. That's why we are low on sausage. Hold up, hold up. Let me Resume let me solve the, the sausage situation your first. Siege will end. What? Ship under attack. Oh, all right, no, it's okay. So you know, there'll be no stopping vengeance. Um. Real quick, real quick, before I tell you what I was, what I uh, was, I was going to say. Um. I need to get a repair dock over here. Is that possible? No. All right. So here's here's a funny meme as well. So say for example, right? I click on the. This is like another one of those things where I feel like they had the idea for it, but they never got to the point of the game. Anyways, look. So say for example, right? This is the one that was costing me a lot of money. Say I, for example, want to pause it. There's a pause button right over there. Guess what it does when you click on it? It just goes to this screen. <laughs> There's a pause button that does absolutely nothing. Take a step back from You make it all up as you go. They put a pause button there. Now what you can do is click the pause button, then click the ship, right? Oh, Learn the ship's the name. Then you go to your actual boats, you find the correct one that's on the trade route, and then you put the boat on the idle button. But there's a there's a there's a pause button on the routes that does nothing. Isn't that weird? Game saved. There's only a pause button on the boat, not on the actual trade route, even though there's a graphic for it. So I kind of feel like those are the kind of things. Could have been anyone. That that like they had a. What? You sunk one of my ships. My ship was destroyed. It's not a pause button. How is that not a pause button? How is that not a... Am I going crazy? Alright, well, if that's not a pause button, I don't know what it is, but... Okay, okay, one more. One more good example of another thing that really bothers me. Maybe it's a Roman numeral, too? Yeah, that could be. 
Here's another thing that like shows to me at least that they've polished the early game really well, but the late game is kind of messy. So say for example, right, you're loading in a sixth item over here, right? Just you're clicking, so. okay, I want to like load in some stuff over here as well, and then I want to unload it over here. If you click the unload button on the right-hand side of the sixth item, so this is not an issue on the first five items, but only in the sixth, the delete button is literally in the same spot as the unload button. Like, that is just... Come on, man. There's no quality control on that kind of stuff. You click unload, and I've had this like three times already where I accidentally delete what this whole row instead. How... You can't make an excuse for that, okay? Now, obviously, it's not a big deal, and it's one of those minor things, but it's a, it's a $60 game. I, sp I spent 60 euro on this. It's, it's, you know... It's not a cheap game, and it, it feels really sloppy. It feels really sloppy. And there's a bunch of stuff like that where I really feel like they could have done... Okay, no more workforce shorts, guys. Okay. They really could have done an easier or a better if job at that kind of thing. Now, you'll be back in time for tennis. <laughs> Ideally, one should keep one. Well, I don't know. Maybe they had some deadlines to meet, right? And they're like, okay, just ship it. It's still a great game, though. Don't get me wrong. It's just like some of these, some of these things I just don't understand. Loco, what? One dollar equals one euro? Yes. <laughs> yes. So if a game is 60 American dollars, it will cost 60 euro as well, which is probably closer to 80 American dollars. Nah, it's an Ubisoft game, Motlessis. So it's to be expected. Not much in the way of common dignity. Do, do, do. Okay, so sausage is improving. My breath has been pretty low. Although I think I just solved that because I didn't have a, a ship on that uh, on that route. Can I have a look at that? This boat... Um, wait, no, I did have a ship on that route. Jabinosaurus. In Joey Ray's Isle, is picking up bread. Do we just need more bread? Because I can make more bread. Is there bread fertility over here? Grain? Nah, certainly not. That is unfortunate. There is grain fertility right here on Leniopolis. So maybe I should get some, uh, some bread production going on over here. I have quite a lot of it already. Actually, this is the majority of my bread production right here, right? Yeah. Just as I thought. The people celebrate your leadership. Local, when the euro came out in 2000, one euro was worth one dollar forty-four. The fire left And right now, one euro is worth one dollar eleven. That's okay. I mean, the Euro has been out for like, what? 20 years? That's a big difference, but 20 years is a long time. I remember when the Euro came out, man. It's been a long time. I remember when they uh, when they released the euro. I don't know if this was true in other countries as well, but they gave every single child in the Netherlands. I don't know if it was all adults as well, but at the very least, I I was I don't know how old I was. I was like eight or something or six. I don't know. But um, every single child in the Netherlands got like a little a little uh, pouch that contained all of the new coins. So it had a 1 cent, a 2 cent, a 5 cent, a 10 cent, a 20 cent, a 50 cent, a 1 euro, and a 2 euro. And I had like a little pouch. And the first thing I did was rip it open. I'm like, oh my god, look at all the money I got. I'm pretty sure if you would have left that wrapped, it's probably worth quite a bit right now. Yeah, they gave you free money. I thought it was really cool. New subscriber detected. Well, f free money. I mean, it's not, you know, <laughs> for, uh, you know, for all intents and purposes.
Daku Black, what's up, man? Thank you for the 19 months. No, I'm a total idiot, Shelmy Rain. I definitely have absolutely no clue about any of that kind of thing. What's... Toxess? What, what does Toxess mean? I had to pay so much stupid money in taxes this year. Ooh, so much. Saddest moment of my life. What am I doing wrong here? Look where your healthcare is free. No, it's not. It's cheap, but it's not free. I need some, uh, some, some, some bricks. Give me bricks. The best bricks you can find. Only the best bricks. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You should, you should, yes. All right. Fields might help. Fields might help. Oh, crap. Yeah, 2018 was a good year. But that automatically also does mean you have to pay a lot more in taxes. I wonder how... I said this before on stream, but I wonder how many streamers out there do not... Like, it doesn't just go for streamers, I guess. But I wonder how many people out there do not take taxes into account. I feel like it's way more than, than there should be. I feel like a lot of people do not realize that you have to pay a big chunk of your income in taxes. Hey, when's tax season actually uh, ending for... Uh... Established an unbreakable chain of supply. I think tax season is, is like, I think it's like May in the United States. Oh, it's already over? April 15th? Ah, okay. Yeah, I had mine all sorted out back in January. It's like, you know what? It's gonna have to <laughs> it's gonna have to be done anyway. Just 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 get it over with. Just just done. Just just you know, just go. You have received your return? Yeah. If you're self-employed, you don't really get returns. So for me, I, I have to pay two different kinds of taxes since I, I'm self-employed, right? So I have to I have to pay a tax called the income tax. That is pretty universal, right? And then there's also a um, revenue tax, right? Now the revenue taxes are quarterly and the income tax is yearly for me. <sighs> now you know it's coming. You know it's coming. And yes, I, I was I was not stupid enough to like not prepare for it or whatever. I, I you know, I save, but still it sucks. Right? You try you try your best and then you know. Oh well. Why is everything so far to the right? Oh my god. Alright. I have to move out everything over. All right, guys. My obsessiveness is just about to be rewarded. <laughs> the royal seal upon it. 
I gotta be careful though, because I'm I'm spending quite a lot of money over in that guy's place. Does he run out, you think? I kinda wanna buy him out, so at some point I'm gonna be back to making more money. Do you run out of stuff? One piece underwear suits. A two prickly. I find singleton shorts and vests to be tried and true. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Archibald Blake, for your underwear advice. Appreciate that, man. How generous. <laughs> uh, so I'm buying sewing machines and pocket watches from him, right? People celebrate your That's what I'm buying right now. Um... How is my sawing machine production looking? Where's the sawing machines at? I don't see the sawing machines. I'm just totally scrolling by it now. Ah, there it is. Yeah, I need to kind of get those. Whoa, that sucks, Triddle. Yeah, I have done, uh, I have done uh, things always the way you're supposed to. I know there's a lot of people like walking in the line, right? They're like, especially if you're self-employed. There's a lot of people walking the line and just your trying to like... Business is what empires upon. Whoa. Why do I have so much money? Did he buy a share? He didn't buy a share. What? How am I getting all of a sudden so much money? I thought he bought a share of my island. Oh, maybe he actually bought a share back. Oh, yeah, he bought a share back. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> Only empires can assimilate. So some of these trades do cost you quite a bit, though. A check copy? That's okay. Maybe I can use some of my influence to get more income. It doesn't uh, indeed taste half as bad as they say. What about? No, that's we will too expensive. All be absolutely behind you. Ten percent more income. Woo! Look at that. Anything else? I'm buying uh, or I'm building warships. Yeah, I'm building quite a few of them. They take a long ass time to build, though. You These take uh, an influence bonus. How much, how much does one of these take to build? I'm not entirely sure. So 15% is two minutes, two and a half minutes. So it takes a while. Yeah, but yeah, taxes are kind of just a thing, right? It's just kind of, kind of how life is. We've run out of copies. I guess it's nicer if you get a, a tax return, right? No tax returns, though, for me. Loco, wait, so let me get this straight. The game that with a mechanic that insta-kills you if you reach zero does not tell you how much it costs to trade? It does not. It doesn't tell you either, and that's the most frustrating part. It does not tell either how much um, you're actually... What? It's a surprise inspection. Oh. It doesn't tell you either how much you actually need of each item. And in the early game, that's fine because you can manage it yourself, but once everything becomes really big, it's basically impossible. Game saved. And it, it's, it's pretty, yeah, it's pretty frustrating, I'm not gonna lie. What's the purpose of buying a share in a guy's island? Uh, your income goes through the roof. You basically um, get a, a percentage of the of the money that he makes, which is really nice. We get dividends. A fire broke out.
When do you usually get text returns? Is that right now? That always struck me as uh, it's kind of funny, at least for me in the Netherlands. Like, whenever you have to pay any taxes or whenever you uh, the government is owed any money, right? You have, like, a pretty short deadline of maybe, like, one month or something to pay the whole thing out, right? They will send you a letter and then you have to pay for the deadline, right? And it makes sense. You can ask for a delay and all that. However, when they have to pay you back, it's like, you know, fingers crossed. Maybe you're going to get it in two months' time if you're lucky. <laughs> It always feels a little bit hypocritical. Uh, I don't know if that's just in the Netherlands, but... That's the case in Portugal, too. My wife and I calculate our taxes in January. If we're owed taxes from the government, then we file immediately. If we owe taxes, we drag our feet till April. <laughs> yeah, that's the threat right there. You've min-maxed the economy. Good, good work. They charge you a fine if you sent the wrong number. I actually once paid, and this is true. Um, I once paid 20 cents too much in taxes. And they sent me like one letter declaring Donation that I spent accepted. 20 cents or that I accidentally sent them 20 cents too much. Then they sent me another letter that they, they are sending me the 20 cents back. And I could decide if I wanted to like get the 20 cents right now. I had to like send the letter back, right? If I wanted the 20 cents back right now, so probably three months, or if I wanted to get a 20 cent deduction on my next tax payment. It's like, dude, I'm glad this is being done right, then it is the correct thing to do, but sending like three letters to organize this whole thing is a complete waste. <laughs> uh, pretty, uh, pretty funny. <laughs> Yo, Alkim, thank you for the 200 bits, man. I appreciate that. Yeah, it is what it is. Can I, uh, can I build that thing yet? Okay, I need filaments. We need 300 filaments. Let's get that organized first. Filaments. Well, I decided to get the 20 cents back, which I did get back, primarily because otherwise I would have to remember that next time I have to make a payment, I have to deduct 20... S <sighs> <laughs> you know, it's going to be a never-ending loop, so I figured, okay, I'll just, you know, get the 20 cents back. I'm curious if that is automated as well, or if that's like someone actually has to manually <laughs> send over 20 cents. Because a lot of it is automated, but not everything. <laughs> I'm missing particular materials. All right. Um, we need to do a couple things. I need to get my filaments. What's it called? Fil filaments? I don't know what that is. Mm. Oh my god. Where's the thing? I don't know where the thing is. Ah, this one. Um, I need coal. Game save. All right, filaments. We just gonna need. Uh, we're just gonna need more coal. How much coal do I have currently? I have maximum coal, so I should be able to get these filaments going pretty quick. All going smoothly. All right. Uh, I also need more light bulbs, so I guess I can put down one more light bulb factory. Which hopefully is going to run smoothly. That one's going to require glass and then filaments. 
Um, so this ratio right here should work out, right? Yeah. So I should I should get this eventually. Are you guys, by the way, powered up? You guys are not powered up, are you? I need an oil power plant over here. Gotta get the power plants. Oh, there's trees. <laughs> Only in Locopia are trees blocking you from building your structures. Because some idiot put down trees all over the world. We are missing all the elements to produce a reaction. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Oh no, don't do that over here, Dark Phoenix. That would suck. <laughs> okay. Um, that's gonna be that one sorted. Next up, in order to continue production on this damn thing once again, I need to get 5,000 investors. Oh my god, 5,000. Can I upgrade you guys? Anyone want to be upgraded? No Why are you guys family, not... Thank you. you guys want coffee? What's going on with the coffee production? Apparently, coffee and rum. Why is my coffee and rum production so bad? By the way, I think this is going to be my final day playing this game. It's been a lot of fun, don't get me wrong. But, um, it was more fun a couple days ago than it is right now. So tomorrow we're going to get back into StarCraft. Maybe we'll start a new save at some point. Who All knows? Right. Um, why is the rum always gone? We have a bunch of rum. All in Her Majesty's name. Rum and coffee, right? Am I growing the coffee over here? I'm starting to lose track of everything I'm doing. Where's coffee? I don't see co- Oh, there it is. Yeah, I'm growing both. Um, I have a stupid amount of rum. Tons and tons and tons of rum. Yet not enough. Let us get started then with producing two more distilleries. And then two more sugarcane plantations. Can't really put that down over here though, because it's gonna block a bunch of my other production. Well, I guess you can be gone. Okay. By the way, if you guys are enjoying the live stream, don't forget to hit the follow button. I mean, who wouldn't want to? Who wouldn't want to follow a stream that where we're talking about taxes? I mean, that's super exciting, right? There's like four accountants like thinking, yes, taxes, taxes, yes. Four politicians in the chat, taxes. Look, I get it. Okay, it just came up. <laughs> Loco, I didn't come here to get reminded about real life. <laughs> like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Thank you, Pwn Random. All right. So, that's rum. Should I set another boat for the rum situation? Ba ba da ba ba da ba ba da ba ba. Oh, 
Uh, where's the rum? Why is the rum gone? Does anyone see rum? Ah. I've got two boats dedicated to the rum situation as it is. How does this work, though? So are they both on this route, bringing back the rum? I think so. I mean, this route couldn't really be any bigger than it is, though. Is this my first Anno game? It is, yes. Okay, you tell me why the rum's always gone. fit over here? It does, but I'm not going to be able to extend it properly. I should play Anno 2025. But guys, it's not even 2025 yet, so I can't. My god, I'm hilarious today. If I was you, I would have subscribed to my live stream ages ago. Okay, no, I'm just kidding. I mean, I would have, but... No! Nobody saw that. Oh, come on. That's not going to work, is it? No fields, no work. Uh, watch. Don't fuck with me, game. Oh, it's fucking with me so hard. I mean, hacking with me. Sorry. Family friendly. Oh, there you go. That wasn't that hard, Loco. Ooh. That's 127 slots. New subscriber. Yo, Detective. Dark Phoenix. Thank you for the tier one sub. I appreciate you. Thank you. My sellout worked. Did it work, Dark Phoenix? We were like, oh my god. Yeah, Loco's right. I should sell out. Uh, I should subscribe. That was your voice, by the way. Did you sound like that? I don't know. Thank you, buddy. Okay. More rum. That's that's more rum right there. Okay, more rum. 14 distilleries. How many did we have earlier? 11 or so? Should be more rum. Next up on the list, coffee. I've got eight coffee plantations over here. Let's bring it to 10. I'm worried that that is not going to be enough either, to be honest. The more people we upgrade, the harder it gets as well to properly manage everything, right? Alright, so I've got six of these right now, which means I need to put down 12 coffee plantations. Save. I'm literally What? Oh, huh, that was weird. Did you see that? Did I have to restart? Wait, when? I did restart once upon a time, yes. Although we've come a pretty long way since though. Oh, we can't go over there. What about over here? Can you go over there? Okay, that, that will do. I did restart um, after doing the campaign. I completed the main story of the campaign. But I didn't want to like 
continue playing that game so much because it wasn't the best safe I've ever made. Let's just leave it at that. <laughs> it was a little sloppy. Really? The game thinks this is beautiful, guys. You know what else is beautiful? You are. That will do. Of course. Come join us. So that should be more coffee. Where's my coffee root? I have a coffee root somewhere. Coffee. Coffee. Lou. Do I have like a an idle boat? Really? All right, Marigold, I guess you are the chosen one now. I feel bad for the poor Honoleros. They will never experience the bliss that comes with progress. Okay. Man, she's being a little condescending though, right? No. She's worried, I guess. Worried and slightly condescending. Top banana! Keep going, man. This is a good route. Alright. So that should make life a little bit easier over in this world. Where we have some happy, happy people. Why do you not have electricity, mate? What's going on? The place is magnificent. What, really? Oh, GG. Literally unplayable. <laughs> I'm gonna need to destroy someone's home! Any volunteers? I'm gonna tapping T. Are you volunteering? Can I destroy your home? What? what? Bunch of plebs over here. Sorry. Put the thing in the thing. There you go. Now you guys get electricity, mate. Look at this. Look at this. Let me speed it up a little bit. You guys are gonna get electricity. How much do these investors give us? Quite a lot. They give us quite a lot of money. I don't really know exactly uh, how much, but we're getting 50k right now. It's a lot. Uh, investors are giving us 62k. Are you guys not gonna get electricity yet? Hold up, hold up. We just need to wait for the oil. It'll be here in a minute. Game. By the way, guys, I will take this opportunity while we wait for the oil to arrive to point out that you can hit the follow button. It is a much appreciated way of, of like just tuning in again in the future. I mean, you get notifications and stuff. It's pretty cool. A competitor's island is under siege. All right, all right, all right. If you're really enjoying the stream, the subscribe button is also an option. Much appreciated. There's also the daily donation goal in the top of the right hand corner. Time for a kid. There's, there's, there's the subscribe button in the top right hand corner if you're interested. There's even a merch store as well. There's a lot of different options. Hey, where's the, uh... Where's the little train? Is this the little train that's gonna go to me? I think it is. These people need electricity, man. My coffee production is pretty bad as well, though. Nope. That was not the one.
It is connected though, right? Yeah, it definitely is. Shortage. I'm gonna need a lot more engineers. Are you gonna go here? Yeah, 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 yeah. Inject yourself into my base. Okay, that sounds weird. Bring the oil is what I'm trying to say. Yes. Guys, electricity. Remember electricity? What? I think it just takes a second. There you go. Finally, man. That's a happy investor right there. Good stuff. Anyways, uh, we are very low right now on engineers. So I think our first order of business is to upgrade some of our artisans into engineers. Now, why can't you guys not be upgraded? Rum? I just made so much more rum. Oh my god, we have a nice little fleet over here. Can I put another one of those things down? I don't need that thing here. There we go. Fleet awaiting orders. Does this take engineers to maintain? Wait! These boats take engineers to maintain? Whoa! I did not know that! Alright, well, we still need him. Yeah, there's never enough rum. The rum's always gone. And I don't know where it's going. It's very frustrating. So it would be awesome if I could pop up like one screen right now that would show us where the rum is going and where we're using it. Um, we have no way. All I can do right now is just guess. Oftentimes, adding on new production seems to work. But I've got two boats going back and forth, filling up on rum. How is there not enough rum? Seriously. Okay, I guess one of the shipments just came in or something, and people are a little more excited again. Now I can upgrade them. It's just a temporary thing. But it works. <laughs> it's a bit strange, though. They apparently now also need electricity over here. Rum is for happiness, not upgrade. So wait, what I needed was soap is what you're trying to say? I actually can upgrade quite a few of these things right now. So I can't upgrade right now because of the school, I guess, then? Yeah, there's a university pretty nearby. I might want to... Um, yeah, happiness and needs are different, apparently. Okay. I might want to... Um, I might want to get a... Um, can I interest you in this recently polished app? Uncompromising journalism. I might want to get myself a power plant over here as well. The festival has ended. Yo, what's going on, Bob? How are you doing today, buddy? You lost an influence bonus. Oh no. I lost an influence bonus. It's not good. Workforce shortage. I'm gonna build a power plant over here. City has grown uglier. Is this a good spot for it, you think? Is that gonna power enough? Game saved. I should have probably thought about that before removing a bunch of homes. I wonder if like one power plant is going to be enough anyway. Nah. I'm gonna need like two. New subscriber detected. Yo, Moy River! Thank you very much. Welcome. I'm gonna have to put one on this side and then one on the other end. That would probably do. So I can put one over here and then one on the other side.
There you go. Very good. And then we also need to put some down over here. So that electricity is going to help out most of the people over here, but not everyone. So we're going to have to do something similar on this side. Do you think I can remove the marketplace already? Do you guys still need the marketplace? You guys don't, right? No. If I upgrade all of my workers here, that would help. Apparently I need more soap, and I also need a school. Don't I have a school here somewhere? Uh, we can put down a temporary school. Oh, I put a school down over here. How do you guys not? You need a no, road. There you go. Is that better? Okay. Those are the homes I want upgraded. Now, while I'm doing that, I do have to worry about the fact that as well, a couple people over here are going to need to get upgraded. That was maybe a little too much. <laughs> Happy as I ever am. Believe me. That was maybe a little much. Got a little ahead of myself. I have no more... F oh my god. I'm low on wood. Sorry guys. It's just a joke. Is there a mass on upgrade button? That'd be nice. I need more lumber. Do I know how to reduce pollution? The only thing I've found is to outsource it to other islands. Ship constructed. That doesn't really uh, give you a solution, though. <laughs> but it's uh, it's the only proper way I think you can do it. Okay. More workers. I don't know if these people are going to need a marketplace over here as well. Probably. Um, yeah, we'll leave it at that. There we go. There should be a couple more workers. Gorgeous. Yeah, they do need a marketplace. Well, it technically still reaches over there. Yeah, it's alright. It'll be, it'll be okay. Ah, <sighs> yeah, no, reducing pollution is a little bit of a tricky one. I haven't found a proper way of really doing that very regularly either. I still have a couple of regular workers, but has ended. we're actually getting to the point right now where I don't have that many of these homes anymore. Your city has grown uglier. That's pretty intense, actually, man. We may actually just be getting rid of all workers on this main island. That's pretty sick. So they have little black-roofed houses right over here, for example. Is that the last of them? Do you guys see any black-roofed houses anywhere? You gotta help me out in this regard, because I'm terrible at seeing these kind of things. Game saved. I don't see any! Do you guys see any? Oh my god, low blinds. I think you guys do see some. Or are you memeing me? Both are excellent options. I don't think there are any, right? Unless I'm crazy. More flexible than you imagined. Yeah, that's what she said. Ba. Ship constructed. Workforce shortage. All right. I have to upgrade these roads, because otherwise the houses in the center bits do not get electricity. They do not build. Um, they do not build electricity 
on these non-paved roads. So you have to put down these paved roads, otherwise they don't receive electricity in the center parts. Did I miss a road? Oh my god, they're super hard to spot. That's okay, we'll get it sorted. Alright. Um, so I've got more than enough engineers right now. We're getting our ligaments set up. Now I just need to make sure I get up to 5,000 investors. It's a lot of investors. And obviously, while I do so, immediately. The amount of engineers that I have go down. Oh my god, this whole neighborhood, though, is becoming top tier. Why can I not? Oh, I'm out of wood? Alright. My god, look at it, though, guys. Ooh, I didn't even notice yet that this whole thing became massive. I've been clicking on it left and right. Yet I did not actually look at it. I clicked on it, but I didn't see. It sounded very poetic. Hey, um, now that I don't have any workers anymore, though, right? To get sick. Does that mean I can remove the marketplace? I think so. I might want to be able to, uh, or I might be able to use this. To my advantage. As I need to put down one of these electricity structures. How much do you cost? Lumber? Really? Why am I low in lumber, out of all things? I guess I can create, I can create a charter route. That brings me some planks. To Locopia. There you go. Just give me some planks. Upgrading these homes takes a lot. Maybe I should create a train rails that goes on this side of the of the thing as well. Because I think there's quite a lot of uh, terrible intersections. All right, do you have oil? Yes. Very good. What is under the investor step? A couple of things. They want to have a members club, for example. Jewelry. As well as gramophones and eventually steam carriages. Now, I'm a, I don't have that one unlocked yet. The coolest one, though, is the World's Fair Foundation, which is this massive-ass structure. They're very pretentious, yes. Very, very, very pretentious. All right. Ooh, okay. Um, how much coal do I still have? More than enough. Okay, that should improve that quite a bit. I need to get 5,000 investors. Right now my coffee is very low. Because apparently there hasn't been a shipment in a little while. Game saved. Um, do you reckon there's maybe a trading route that I can pick up over here instead? That might be a smart idea. I think I want to stop buying over here. It's costing me too much. The guy rips me off. Oh, he doesn't have bread anymore. Um, what is it we want to buy again? Coffee. He doesn't have any beer anymore there either. What about over here? Do you have anything cool over here? No coffee anywhere.
Low on coffee is reason for panic. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, these investors, they drink Donation a lot of coffee, confirmed. it seems. Oh my god. Bob! Once again with the 20 euro donation. My man. Thank you very much for the generosity. If I could see a round of hearts in the chat. That'd be awesome. Thank you, man. It's four hours in a row. Time to stretch your legs. Time to stretch my legs. Well, I do have to go to the bathroom. So, you know, there is that. <laughs> There's rum. We can buy rum over here. That'd be nice. Thank you very much, Bob. Thank you for filling in the donation goal. Don't know if you did that intentionally, but you did. Thank you. Appreciate that. Seriously. More rum. So much rum. I am looking for coffee. Yes, that's what we need. Coffee. Buy, buy the coffee and then head back home to, to Locopia. This is by far the longest and most confusing New trip. Detected. Woo. <laughs> that guy has a, a very difficult trading route ahead of him. I guess it will do. I guess it will do.